I know that many of you really want to get started, so I, I just keep that um, brief and simple. Um, so what I present is called Sunbeam. Um, it's a small wrapper around the EOSJS library. Um, it's used to interact with the um, contract that Jeff wrote in C++. Um, the um, focus is on speed as well and also on for the small file size because we want to make it um, work nicely in the browser as well. Um, it also works in Node.js. We use a lot of Node.js at Bitfinex. Uh, later I will give a talk on, on, on a few backend systems we use at Bitfinex in production. Um, so this is basically how you use Sunbeam right now. You just require Sunbeam, then you require EOSJS as a dependency. Um, right now you have a read node conf and a write node conf. And that will fall uh, away with the usage of the plugin that um, Jeff just presented. Right now uh, Sunbeam doesn't use the plugin yet. Um, it directly connects to the EOS node, and the so when 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 I wrote that, I thought I, I don't want to give that to you as a tool; it's open source, um, and um, let you hack with that, and you leave this place with bad, bad practices. Um, so right now, to work around the fact that an EOS node will cache your transaction. Um, we use a read node and a write node, so um, that way we want to make sure that you don't uh, rely on cache data. Um, there's also a way to uh, use the same configuration, um, it's in the gist I sent you later. So what I do, I pass that configuration together with my account name um, to create an Sunbeam instance, and we have a few um, um, methods uh, you can use. It's uh, order book to obviously retrieve the order book, then orders to retrieve your current currently placed orders. Uh, you can cancel orders and you can create orders and then place them into the contract. So I want to walk with you through um, an example how to use Sunbeam uh, by creating an order and then submitting it. Um, if, are you familiar with the Bitfinex API? Who has used the Bitfinex WebSocket API? Oh yeah, well. So um, this should be familiar to you if you use the uh, Node.js uh, WebSocket client. We are creating an exchange limit order, sending, and uh, then we have an order object, and we can pass it to Sunbeam, to the place method, and it will send it for us to the contract. Uh, the whole thing is on GitHub, bitfinex.com, uh, uh, bitfinex.com, Sunbeam. Um, and to get started, you have three main entry points. It's, it's the README. So in the README, all API uh, endpoints are documented. You can use with Sunbeam, and there's also some information how to get started. There's example.js. You can uh, run that with node, and then it will um, throw requests against all uh, contract endpoints, contract actions. And then there's the browser exchange. I worked on that this week, uh, which I quickly want to demo you now. It's a small uh, exchange. Um, let me just get that ready. To mirror the display, so you can see something. Great. Cool. So um, that's the Sunbeam repository. Um, I quickly switch to the test. Oh, can you see that? Um, we go to test uh, browser exchange. Okay. Exchange. I run node.js. Mm -hmm. Okay, it 
um, gives me a small dev server. And now um, I have my small exchange here. Um, I'm going to log in with user test123. Um, and I have um, a list of my current positions. Um, and at the bottom, there's an order book. Um, like with the Bitfinex UI, you have a small red circle for your own orders, and the orders uh, that don't have a small red circle are not your own orders. Um, so when I want to cancel my position for my set, I just click in my positions uh, list on the small cancel button. Okay, then it disappears. It also disappears from the order book. Um, let's just place in another order. So, Bitcoin got really expensive. So, <laughs> so let's just trade uh, a small fraction and then let's, let's price it at. Nice. So we did. Yeah, here we go. The demo gods were happy with me, so um, I'm happy that the demo work is also open source. It's part of the part of the project in the test folder. Um, yeah, that's the API docs I just mentioned. Here's the repository github.com, bitfinex.com, Sunbeam. I sent that in the Telegram channel. Um, that's the documentation for place uh, that I just uh, showed in the slides. Um, Here's the example JS. Um, I have a nice transform flag, so I can use the Bitfinex API v2 style as well. So there are a few nice options you can use. Um, that's basically it. Um, yeah. And happy hacking, everyone. Thank you. <laughs>